disproportionately African American, Latino, and Native American. The time is long overdue for major reforms to a broken and racist criminal justice system. And what we are going to do together is invest in our young people in good jobs and good education, not more jails and incarceration. It costs less money to send a kid to the University of Illinois than to lock him up. Let's send him to the university. Today in America, 400,000 people are in jail right now who have not been convicted of anything. They're in jail because they cannot afford cash bail, the 500 bucks they need to get out of jail. Together we're going to end cash bail in America. Together we're going to end private prisons and detention centers. Corporations should not be making millions locking up fellow Americans. And together we are going to end the incredibly destructive war on drugs. Now it turns out that there are some things that a president can do with executive order, other things you need legislation. Just so happens that with an executive order, a president can make marijuana legal in every state of this country. And I invite you to the ceremony when we do just that. know somebody who was arrested for possession of marijuana. We're going to move to expunge the records of those arrested for marijuana. And when we talk about broken and racist systems, we're going to overhaul our immigration system. I am the proud son of an immigrant who came from Poland. I have the feeling I'm not the only person here who has family that came from Poland. My father came to this country, like many of your parents, without a nickel in his pocket, couldn't speak a word of English, had limited education. I will not accept the demonization of the immigrant community. This is a country built by ignorant, by <laughs> immigrants. This is a country built by slaves. And we have got to appreciate who built this country, who made it great. It was not the folks on Wall Street. It was working people, black and white and Latino, Native American, Asian American. Those are the people who made this country great. <laughs>